Hello everybody! In this video I will demonstrate a simple way to remove a coaxial cable terminal lock. As you can see if you try to remove this lock it just spins freely. So let's quickly explore what doesn't work and of course what does. While initially trying to figure this out I saw on some forums that needle nose pliers might do the trick. With this pair though there's just no way to reach or clamp down on the inside cuff which is the part that physically connects to the cable splitter. Also, just turning a screwdriver doesn't do anything. At least one how-to video says to snip the lock apart. But on this one, the metal is just too durable to cut. Another video suggests really clamping down over where the inner cuff is with some pliers or vice grips and then start spinning the lock off. This may work for your situation, but once again on this particular lock, the metal is just too solid. Another instructional has you super gluing hex keys together inside the lock. We're just not going to do that. So that leaves this method, using a small flathead screwdriver. If you take a close look inside the lock, you can see two notches, where the cable company's specialty tool connects. It's one at the top. And one at the bottom there. Work the tip of the screwdriver into one of those notches. And you should then be able to start removing the lock. It'll take quite a few turns, but you'll get there. And there it is, another task successfully done. If you'd like more info about this process, check out the link to our blog post below, or visit our page directly by typing in kilmermedia.net. If you found this video helpful, please like or comment, since that helps other people find it. Thank you all for watching, and see you next time!